the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. The Lord be with you and with your spirit. Brothers and sisters, brothers and sons, shall we say this and so prepare ourselves to celebrate the faith of the mystery. Lord, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. Christ, have mercy. Christ, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. May Almighty God have mercy on us, forgive us our sins, and bring us to God's life. Let us pray. O God, and who made your people partakers in your redemption, grant we pray that we may perpetually render thanks for the resurrection of the Lord. For the same way to the unity of the Holy Spirit, one God, forever and ever. Amen. A reading from the Acts of the Apostles. Paul left the Athens and went to Corinth. There he met a Jew named Aquila, a native of Pontus, who had recently come from Italy with his wife Priscilla, because Claudius had ordered all the Jews to leave Rome. He went to visit them, and because he practiced the same trade, stayed with them and worked, for they were tent makers by trade. Every Sabbath he entered into discussions in the synagogue, attempting to convince both Jews and Greeks. When Silas and Timothy came down from Macedonia, Paul began to occupy himself totally with preaching the word, testifying to the Jews that Christ was Jesus. When they opposed him and reviled him, he shook out his garments and said to them, Your blood be on your heads. I am clear of responsibility. From now on, I will go to the Gentiles. So he left there and went to a house belonging to a man named Titus Justus, a worshiper of God. His house was next to a synagogue. Crispus, the synagogue official, came to believe in the Lord along with his entire household. And many of the Corinthians who heard believed and were baptized. The word of the Lord. Thanks be to God. The responsorial psalm is, The Lord has revealed to the nations his saving power. The Lord has revealed to the nations his saving power. Sing to the Lord a new song, for he has done wondrous deeds. His right hand has won victory for him, his holy arm. The Lord has revealed to the nations his saving power. The Lord has made his salvation known. In the sight of the nations, he has revealed his justice. He has remembered his kindness and his faithfulness toward the house of Israel. The Lord has revealed to the nations his saving power. All the ends of the earth have seen the salvation by our God. Sing joyfully to the Lord, all you lands. Break into song, sing praise. The Lord has revealed to the nations his saving power. Alleluia, alleluia, alleluia. Alleluia, alleluia, alleluia. I will not leave you orphans, says the Lord. I will come back to you. And your hearts will rejoice. Alleluia, alleluia, alleluia. The Lord be with you. And with your spirit. Amen. Yeah, the gospel according to John. Glory to you, O Lord. Jesus said to his disciples, A little while, and you will no longer see me. And again, a little while, later, and you will see me. So some of his disciples said to one another, What does this mean that he said to us? A little while and you will not see me, and again a little while and you will see me. And because I am going to the Father. So they said, This is what is this little while of which he speaks? We do not know what he means. Jesus knew that they wanted to ask him. So he said to them, Are you discussing with one another what I said? A little while and you will not see me. And again, a little while, and you will see me. Amen, amen, I say to you, I will weep and mourn while the world rejoices. You will weep, but your grief will become joy. The gospel of the Lord. Praise to you, Lord Jesus Christ. Keeping our eyes fixed on the promise of salvation, we bring our petition to our merciful Father. For all bishops, priests, and deacons, may God continue to sanctify and purify them in their sacred ministry. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. 
for those who are struggling in their faith, may God look graciously upon them, and the Holy Spirit help them to grow in truth. Let us pray to the Lord. For all of us, that uh, we may, through the outpouring of the Holy Spirit, may we faithfully live the truth of the gospel. We pray to the Lord. Let's pray for today's intentions for Frank Girardi and souls in purgatory. We pray to the Lord. Lord hear our prayer. For all who have been passed away in the hope of the resurrection, may they be welcomed into the victory of Christ. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord hear our prayer. God of joy, hear our prayers today. We ask this into Christ our Lord. Blessed are you, O God, of creation, for in your goodness we have received the bread we offer you, fruit of the earth, and all of human hands, it will become for us the bread of life. Blessed be God, our Father. Blessed are you, O God, of creation, for in goodness we have received wine we offer you, fruit of the vine, and all of human hands, it will become our spiritual drink. Blessed be God. Pray, brothers and sisters, that my sacrifice and yours may be acceptable to God, the Almighty Father. May the Lord accept the sacrifice of your hands for the praise and glory of his name, for our good and good of all his holy church. May our prayers rise up to you, O Lord, together with the sacrificial offering, so that, purified by your graciousness, so we may be confirmed to the mysteries of your mighty love, through Christ our Lord. Amen. The Lord be with you. And with your spirit. Lift up your hearts. We lift them up. Let us give a thanks to the Lord our God. Right and just. It is true, right and just, our duty and our salvation at all times to obtain your Lord, but in this time of our all to love you even more graciously. When Christ our Passover has been sacrificed, for he is the true Lamb who has taken away the sins of the world, by dying has destroyed our death, and by rising restored our life. Is therefore overcome with prosper joy at the end of the people exalt in your praise, and even the heavenly powers with the angelic hosts sing together the amazing hymn of your glory, as they are praying. Holy, holy, holy Lord God of hosts, heaven and earth are full of your glory. Hosanna in the highest. Blessed is he who comes in the name of the Lord. Hosanna in the highest. You are indeed holy Lord, the fountain of all our holiness, the main holy, therefore the deep gives you praise by sending love your spirit upon them like the duple, so that that is, they may become for us the body and blood of our Lord Jesus Christ. At the time he was betrayed and entered willingly into his passion to his breath, and giving a thanks, he broke and gave it to his disciples, saying, Hey, this all of you, and be done with for this is my body, which will be given up for you. In a similar way, when supper was ended, he took the chalice, and once more giving a thanks, he gave it to his disciples, saying, Hey, this all of you, and drink from it, for this is the chalice of my blood, the blood of the new and eternal covenant, which will be put out for you and for many for the forgiveness of sin. Do this in a of me. The mystery of faith, we proclaim your death, O Lord. Best for resurrection until you come again. As therefore, as we celebrate the memorial of his death and resurrection, we offer you all the, the bread of life and the chalice of salvation, giving a thanks as we have heard that word, to be in your presence and minister to you. Family, we pray that partaking of the body and blood of Christ, we may be gathered into one by the Holy Spirit. Remember all your church, spread it throughout the world, and bring her to the fullness of charity. Together we grant some hope and grace our bishop and all the clergy. Remember all the brothers and sisters who have fallen asleep in the hope of the resurrection, and all who have died in your mercy. Welcome and examine to the light of your face. Have mercy on us all, we pray, that with the blessed Virgin Mary, Mother of God, who is in 
know that when Moshe fasted, the rest of the fasted, the same exactly. And all the saints and angels are the angels. We may marry to be coerced with the light. We may praise and glorify you through your Son, Jesus Christ. To him and with him and with him, 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 O God Almighty Father, and thy angel of God, for his spirit, O glory be the Son, Lord, is yours, for Deliver us, Lord, we pray from every evil, precious we grant peace in our days, and that by the help of your mercy may be always free from sin and safe from all distress, as we await the blessed hope and the coming of our Savior, Jesus Christ. For the kingdom, the power, and the glory are yours now and forever. Lord Jesus Christ, we said to your apostles, be the living and be the giver, to look not on our sins, but on the faith of your church, and precious we grant your peace and unity in accordance with your word, for ever way, for ever the peace of the Lord is your way to get your spirit. Let us offer each other the sign of peace. Lamb of God, you take away the sins of the world, have mercy on us. Lamb of God, you take away the sins of the world, have mercy on us. Lamb of God, you take away the sins of the world, grant us peace. Behold, Lamb of God, behold the hem of the days away the sins of the world, for there are those who the son of Lamb. Lord, I am not worthy that you should enter under my roof, but only say the word, my soul shall be delivered. May the Bible bless you. Let us pray. <clears throat> Almighty and living God, who restore us to eternal life in the resurrection of Christ, increase in us we pray the truth of the Paschal Sacrament and pour into our heart the strength of the same truth through Christ our Lord. Amen. The Lord be with you and with your spirit. May Almighty God bless the Father, the Son. The Holy Spirit, Amen. The message ended. Go in peace. Thanks be to God.